What up, guys? This is Casey's Raw again. This is part 10 of consoles, games, and stories from my life. Today is about the Sega Dreamcast. This one right here is my second one I owned. Uh, this is the Black Sport Edition of the Sega Dreamcast. I think it's kind of sexy looking system. I think I had this for a few years now. Uh, not 100% sure if I picked it up when I was in Pennsylvania or when I picked it up in Oklahoma. But um, the story why how I picked up the, my first Dreamcast was a it was me and my wife in Pennsylvania. There's a flea market just outside Strasburg, Pennsylvania. It's a giant flea outdoor flea market. And we would go do our runs. We'll weave in and weave out through the aisles. And uh, there was one vendor. I When they have like boxes on the ground with a bunch of junk, I usually won't take time of day to really look at it. But uh, my wife would just happen to walk by and she looked down. She's like, Casey, there's a Sega Dreamcast there. We asked the person. It was a Dreamcast, a controller, and a VMU for $15. Like, hell yeah. I was stoked about that. But uh, we, could, we brought it home. wasn't working. But, so found out eventually is because we didn't pl push the, in the port all the way into the AV port into the console all the way in. But we went to a store, a flea market, not too far from the uh, Strasburg uh, flea market and got another one. And we enjoyed that for several years. And then uh I saw this one. I believe I turned around and I sold that just to get this version. Because I think it's sexy as hell. And I want the more uncommon one. Like I have the original Xbox where it's uh, the Green Halo Edition Xbox. So I want the Sega Sports edition of the Dreamcast. So, um, let's check the other items I got. In the last month and a half or so, I picked up the three box Sega Dreamcast items. First, I picked up the Sega Dreamcast RF adapter. And I was like, I think I picked it up between five and ten bucks. And I saw it was an RF adapter in its box for Dreamcast. I'm like, oh my god, that's funny. Like, why would you want an RF adapter when it comes with AV cables? So, but I saw it's in box, and I love my box things, and it's weird. So I had to get it. Next, I picked up a Sega Dreamcast controller in its box story about that um, I went to my local game store and the price was on there was 30 bucks I told them I really don't need the controller can you work a deal cut the price down and they dropped it down to 10 but before I did this stream I found it felt heavy, and I opened it up and had a controller. I'm like, I don't remember putting a controller in here. I mean, I have a bad memory, but uh, I opened it up, and it was nicely packed in. And knowing me, I don't nicely pack anything, especially putting stuff in their boxes. So um, I think they just mistakenly put a Dreamcast in there, a Dreamcast controller in there. And last night, I picked up, well, yesterday, I picked up this Sega Dreamcast and its box. Uh, I was talking to Rose about this, and I was 
on the fence. Not saying that I didn't want it, but I was uh, uh, I was like, oh, can I afford it right now? It's 80 bucks. Uh, calculated the funds. I was like, okay, I should be fine if I just not spend anything after. So I, I had to get it, and I hardly ever see them in their boxes. So, um, then I was also thinking maybe sell the Dreamcast, but you see, I got the black one, so I don't like, I got, if it's the black box, and then I can understand selling the second one, but I'd rather have a NAR Dreamcast in here, just because it's in its box, and God forbid that other Dreamcast goes bad, I have a backup. So let's look at the other items as well. This getup right here is a microphone that you use for the game Seaman or Sea Man. Uh, the game's kind of funny. Uh, it's cool to play. The narrator is Spock. Learn, lean. Uh, hard for me to pronounce. Leon Nimoy. He's the narrator. But yeah. But this is the size of VMU cart as well. But instead of the microphone. They would have a screen. And the pad or directional pad. And a couple buttons right here. Probably A or B button. And um. I actually had a box. VMU, but I don't know where it is right now. And I also have a Sega Dreamcast keyboard, and I wish I had one in this box as well, but I wish. But at least I got it loose. So let's check the games out. Starting with Blitz 2000. Uh, back in the day, I loved playing this game on the arcade. I uh, enjoyed playing it on the N64, the GameCube, and the other systems. I hadn't really... I hadn't played this one. This is actually sealed right now. I mean, it's not new, but I hadn't played this one now. I had played this Sonic Adventures too. It's a good game. I enjoyed it. I highly suggest playing the Sonic Adventure, uh, Adventure games. Then you got Roaster. Obviously, it's a racing game. Rayman 2. I should get that a shot. ECW Revolution. I think I played this on the on the N sixty four. True True Rocket. Looks kinda interesting game. I need to give it a shot. And I got coaster warts. Honestly you make your own Roller coasters. Mag Force. Racing. A racing game. And then that, you get a bunch. Then here's NBA 2K. This is when 2K was actually good. Then this is the game I was telling you about. Seaman. And that's your character. You. Fish with a human's face that talks. I suggest to watch that angry video game nerd on it. He did a really funny episode on it. Uh, Sonic Adventures. I actually think I prefer this one over the other one. And another sports game, baseball. 2K. This is 
some kind of demo. I get it says Sega Dreamcast um magazine. I bet that's a demo. Uh, at one of the last uh too many games, I picked up this and the fishing controller. Uh, I would have to fish it. Yeah, the fish the controller out, but it's not that important. And then you got Star Wars Episode One Jedi powers. Caesar's Palace two thousand. It's Caesar's Palace. <laughs> uh, Air Force Delta. I love my jet games. Another fishing game. Sea Marine Fishing. I wonder if that works on the fishing pole. I assume it does. Trick style. I guess this is a skateboarding game for a dollar fifty. Why not? Uh, NFL Two K One football, and I got a ton of sports. Sports Jam. Looks like it's college football. NFL quarterback club two thousand. Zombie revenge. And our NCAA football game. Stream sports. Nice. Worms Armageddon. Here's a big one. Shamu on the Sega Dreamcast. Must have Rainbow Six. This is another one of those uh, Sega Dreamcast magazine deals. Mortal Kombat Gold. I like my Mortal Kombats. I think the artwork is a fat is reproduction. Atari. Pretty much a bunch of arcade games from Atari. So Sonic Shuffle. This is if you play Mario Party, this is like Mario Party, but this is just horrible. Play Mario Party instead. The Royal Rumble. This is a Sega Dreamcast exclusive for wrestling. I played WWF Attitude on the N64. It might have looked a little bit better on here than, uh, than... See, it gotta be. It's double the bits. Bass fishing. Not a fishing game. Ready to rumble. Boxing. Buzz Lightyear. Start of Star Command. I think this is double. NFL 2K1. Crazy Taxi 2. I like ta Crazy Taxi games. 18 Wheeler. The next Tetris Online ed 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 Edition. Virtual Tennis. Sydney 2000 Olympics. Vigilante 8. The second offense. I found the VMU. It was happened to be in there. This is a box VMU. This is what a VMU looks like. 
So. Looks pretty awesome. I was, they told me it's the real deal. And I was shocked. I was like, okay, awesome. I'll pick that up. Uh, test drive. Obviously, another uh, racing game. This is the very last LJN game. Spirit a Speed 1937. Awful game. A UFC game. I think this artwork's been reproed as well. But the game looks real. And these are def uh, more memory cards right here in the case. Most likely third party, uh, third party, uh, memory cards. Uh, that is it. I'm glad I found this VMU to show you guys. I've been looking around for it. Now I'm happy to find it. But, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.